Hello, I'm Rob Witcher, and today I'm going to provide a simple definition of what the heck is the TCB. What is the TCB, the Trusted Computing Base? Here's a pretty good definition. The totality of protection mechanisms within a system. Let's decompose this sentence and understand what do each of these words, what do each of these pieces mean? And let's start with totality. Totality simply means the collection, the assembly, everything. In fact, all of the components, all of the protection mechanisms within a system. So totality simply means all, everything within a system that's responsible for the security of that system. Now, what about protection mechanisms? What does that mean? Well, that is all of the hardware. All of the firmware. And all of the software within a system that is responsible for the security of that system. So when we say hardware, what's an example of the hardware protection mechanism? Well, a good example might be something like a TPM, a trusted platform module. What's a TPM? Well, it's a secure crypto processor. This is the little chip that gets installed in things like laptops where the encryption keys are securely stored. Whenever you have something like whole drive encryption, those encryption keys need to be securely stored somewhere and where they're stored on the TPM. Now, what about firmware? What is firmware? Well, firmware is the low level little bits of software that control the hardware. And what would be an example of a, of a protection mechanism within firmware? Well, something like code signing. We want to make sure that the firmware that we are running on a system is the actual firmware that was created by the manufacturer and it, not, it hasn't been modified by any attackers. And so code signing would be an example of a protection mechanism, of a firmware protection mechanism. And finally, what about software? What are exam of examples of software protection mechanisms? I'm sure you can think of many of them. One example might be, say, the anti-malware system that looks for things like viruses and worms and trojans and all those sorts of things. It could also be things like our host-based firewall or, and this is some important terminology to relate the TCB to, it could be security kernels. Any of the mechanisms within, any of the software mechanisms that control a subject's access to an object, that's known as a security kernel. The, it's the implementation of the RMC, the Reference Monitor Concept. So in summary, what is the TCB? Well, if you look at an entire system, like say a laptop, and you think about all of the components within that laptop, the hardware, the CPU, the RAM, the software, the operating system, the applications, the TCB is simply the subset of components. And it's those components that are specifically related, specifically designed to protect the system. That's the TCB.